Checking it on that sideline, trying to give Cumberland no space. They got Walsh gets some space on the wing. Looking to cross it in, just dinks it over the top, and it trickles in for a Early. goal. Just minutes in. Trying to play it downfield, bobbling around some heads. Eventually flicked on a Tiri Yules, who has some space in the box. Takes a shot right at Bennett Strutz. The player to defend. Back with Cumberland University at the top of the box. They get a shot off straight at the keeper. There's few teams that can make Route 1 soccer look attractive, but Cumberland University definitely do it as they get a goal right there off the back post. Corner coming in. From and gets the foul right there. Quick ball being played by Scrosh Dodd. And it looks like that's going to nearly... Uh, subbed out uh, a little bit ago. Oof, a fantastic service. Uh, they're still. It's kind of up in the air whether they're going to get an at-large bid or not. But at his feet, Tyler Watson on it now. Got some space to work with. And if you give that man an inch of space, he's going to use it. Nearly uh, scored. Fast pace that the game is being played at. Ball goes over the top to Danny Williams. Has a little bit of space. Tries to chip it over the goalkeeper, and that is high of the goal right there. And, you know, if it had fallen with a little bit just less power, it would have been a beautiful kick. And Martin Walsh with the ball right now intercepts it and scores right there. Uh, you know, uh, just. He he was my goalkeeper of the tournament last year as he uh, comes away with Danny Williams on the ball now. Looking to find, well, can't tell who that is. That's uh, Kevin Pierce on, through on the ball, on goal right there. And he slots it home for the fourth goal for Lynn. Circle. So they do a really good job of creating space that way by kind of fluctuating in and out of where they go and, you know, kind of making the defenders switch up who they have to guard. And uh, that's.